Alright everyone, we are back. Hello Diddles, welcome to the channel. If you are new, I am Z. We have the Reign of Kendo about love. Now, Santiago sent this to me, which he is an angel. Just in case you didn't know, Santiago is an angel. And he sent this to me, um, told me I didn't have to do it today because all oh, that's been going on and take time. He's very patient, very kind. All of my patrons are and I'm very, very thankful for that. Um, he said this is a little bit poppier, but he felt it could be interesting. I don't have a rule about um, what I do on my channel. All genres are welcome. <laughs> I might have a few choice words. If you choose a country or bluegrass song, please none of you do that to fuck with me. Please just don't. But uh, <laughs> if that's what you're really into and you want me to listen to it, I'm totally up for it. Just. I mean, I might have a few choice things to say. Everything is welcome. I enjoy all but those two. Um, metal, you know, metalcore, melodic metal it just happens to be my favorite. So, here we go about love. Why can't I sing a song about love, Back. sing about something I know nothing of, a kiss on the cheek, a touch of the hand, my knees feeling weak, my heart feeling grand. song about love Perhaps I'm a dreamer that doesn't wake up I'm soaring through skies in a red paper cup And I'm falling through trees with pillows for leaves I might fall but I won't skin my knees All the love that I've found Perhaps I am frightened It won't stick around But if I take courage And expose my heart There's nothing to keep us Keep us apart vibrato and control absolutely beautiful you know there were some parts of the song that we've hit so far and I'm like where, where's he gonna take this where's he gonna go with this is he gonna stay kind of monochrome with it you don't know what that means but it makes sense in my head like is he gonna kind of stay monochrome with it is he gonna really go for it and so far I've I'm really liking what he's doing with the song Thank you. 
pretty illustrious song little illustrious song writing apparently i can't english very well today sorry i'm old i'm an old lady i had to put my glasses on to see from back here um oh look my hair actually wants to kind of show blind a little bit i think the sun's peeking out um okay thoughts I don't think I've ever heard a genre like this before. It's, um, I wonder if Apple has, um, what genre did they classify this under? Does it say? Um, oh, following the departure of their lead singer and guitarist in late 2006, the remaining members of the Buffalo-based atmospheric pop combo this day and age regrouped under the name Reign of Kendo. Bassist Joey stepped out front, assuming lead vocal and guitar duties. Okay, that makes sense. Then there was, um, anyways, his old slot was filled by new bassist Jeff Jarvis, who joined guitarist Mike Carroll, pianist Kelly, mm -hmm, and drummer Steve. The Rain of Kendo's music was altogether jazzier than its predecessors, maintaining the introspective Brit-pop influences of bands like Coldplay and Keen. I did get a Keen vibe, but placing the piano front and center and mixing complex jazz harmonies and dissonances with the pop sensibilities of a Ben Folds. Still, design, still signed to this day and age's old label, 111 Records, the Rain of Kendo issued a self-titled EP as their debut release in 2007. Their first few length feel, feel Full-length album, rhythm, chord, and melody arrived in 2008. In the summer of 2009, the group parted ways with 111 and signed to the Candy Rat label. So, not much about them since 2008 in their bio. Like, you know, I did get a Keen vibe from them. That's not, I mean, that's not a bad thing. Keen is great. Love Keen. Um... Somewhere Only We Know, which is the most, like, cliche song um, to say is your favorite by them, but it really is. Like, I love that song. Whenever I get, like, super upset at work, I play Somewhere Only We Know because it just has that, that Calgon take me away, you know? You know, every time I say take me away, I think of that Seether song. Um, it was off Disclaimer, too. It was a more of an acoustic song. But anyways, I liked it. I might add this to my Calm Down Z playlist because I don't know. It did it's like jazzy pop, but then that doesn't encompass it all either. I don't know. I like I liked it. I just don't know where I would want to listen to this like as far as what mood I don't think I have a mood for it yet but anyways thank you Santiago so much I'll I'll find a playlist to put it in um it really wouldn't work for gaming it really wouldn't work for shower I'll probably try to put it in my Calm Down Z playlist, because I do have a playlist named that. Um, but yeah, I don't know, but thank you very much.